Hello, I'm Nick Finkenauer, a tax director at McGowan, Hearst, Clark & Smith. Today's topic of discussion is pass-through taxation and the changes pass-through businesses are facing as a result of tax reform. First, what is a pass-through business? A pass-through business is an entity where all income, deductions, and credits pass through to the owner of the business. The owner then reports the income, deductions, and credits on their personal tax return. Pass-through businesses can be organized as sole proprietorships, partnerships, or S-corporations. Now why is there such a fuss about pass-through businesses in wake of tax reform? It's because of the new Qualified Business Income Deduction. At its simplest, the Qualified Business Income Deduction, or QBI deduction, is a 20% haircut on income from a pass-through business. For example, if you had pass-through business income of $100,000, you could potentially receive a $20,000 deduction, which only makes $80,000 of that pass-through income taxable. However, since it's the tax code, it can get much more complicated. Depending on your taxable income, there is either a one-part or a two-part test to calculate the deduction. The one-part test kicks in if your taxable income, which is adjusted gross income less the standard deduction or itemized deduction, is less than $315,000 for a married filing joint taxpayer. If this is the case, then you receive an automatic 20% deduction on your pass-through income. However, what if your taxable income is greater than $315,000? The one-part test becomes a two-part test. The first part of this test is figuring out your allocated wages and property from the pass-through business. These amounts are now required to be reported to you by partnerships and S-corporations that you may own an interest in. The second part of this test is whether the pass-through business is a specified service trader business. Depending on the answer to these two questions, the 20% deduction could be reduced or even eliminated. If your taxable income is greater than $315,000 or you have multiple pass-through businesses, your QBI deduction can be incredibly complex to calculate. Please reach out to your tax professional at McGowan, Hearst, Clark & Smith to learn more about the Qualified Business Income Deduction and what your businesses can do to maximize your tax savings. Be sure to check out our YouTube channel for other valuable topics to view, learn, and share. If you have questions, please give us a call, drop us an email, or stop by. We are happy to help. Thanks.